Alright, uh, I already filmed one intro, but, uh, I don't know, I didn't like it. Uh, I'm going to hit chest today. Homie's running late, who I'm hitting it with, so, uh, I went and stopped by this, uh, played against sports and found this, uh, somewhat vintage looking leather belt. I don't think it's vintage, but, like, it just looks used and old, so it's cool. And I think it's reversed, but it was 14 fucking dollars. Like, it's a thick, sturdy-ass belt. Uh, yeah, it's a small, so I do adjust it. It, uh, it fits me, but, uh, snugly. And, uh, I don't know. My, I'm, I'm trying to gain weight right now. I'm trying to bulk up. Uh, my cutoff is like 210. And I was 197 this morning. I've been fluctuating between uh, like 200 pounds and 197, just depending on like water retention, uh, how much food I'm eating. Uh, on a, any given day, like, how voluminous the food is, because, like, it's n okay, that's a shit example, cut that out, we're cutting that out, let's say you eat a bunch of super calorically dense food, since it's dense, there isn't going to be as much volume, since you're not eating as much volume of food, the weight gain and water retention won't be as high. So on the days where I'm like, to be honest, on the days where I'm eating good, you know, like eating some rice, some veggies, some beef, I'll be hitting that 200 pound in the morning. But, uh, yeah, just trying to keep getting some calories in. Most days I do pre do pretty good about mostly eating like white rice, and meat, and vegetables. Uh, I will definitely have some fucking processed ass carbs though, like right before or during working out. So, but yeah, I uh, got that belt. It was a good deal. I also picked up wrist straps. These probably aren't the best wrist straps. They're definitely not the best, but it'll work. I, uh, I don't know what the fuck happened to my last ones. Uh, I probably just wasn't paying attention, set them down in the gym somewhere, or they like fell out of my bag. But uh, new wrist straps, so the wrist will be protected uh, this push day. Not that I need it, probably. I ain't going super heavy. But just in case they, they start giving me issues, it's always nice to have. Especially, like, you don't have to use wrist wraps only for push day. Sometimes I use wrist wraps for back squatting or front squatting. Uh, I don't know. I got kind of, like, thin, dainty wrist. There's a little forearm vein action for you. But I got little, little thin, dainty wrist. Uh, they kind of be getting hurt frequently. Uh, so like, whenever I'm in a front rack position or I'm back here holding the bar, sometimes helps just to have a wrap around there to keep it from getting too inflamed or strained. But uh, yeah, I guess that's it. Uh, see y'all at the gym. All right, what's up, guys? Uh, just starting off on incline here. Did a couple warm ups. Uh, just shooting for like 10 reps on this first set. Felt good. Felt, uh, felt relatively uh, light. I mean, it's only 135, so should be light. But, uh, yeah, I think I, yeah, I threw uh, another five on each side. 
Shout out to my homie Ben. He's spotting me today and working out with me. And uh, he was killing that shit. So shout out to homie Ben coming and working out with me. But uh, yeah, just uh, trying to get my reps in, volume. Just trying to prepare the chest for hard contractions, I guess. Kind of been taking a break from flat bench, uh, just because elbow issues, shoulder issues. I find that if I keep it light on the incline, here we're doing some forced reps, I guess. Uh, ben didn't really know exactly what I was meaning whenever I was uh, wanting to do some forced reps, but we got it done. Um, here we switched over to a uh, chest machine and uh, this I wasn't even really counting reps I just wanted to go to failure a lot safer switching over to machine for failure work I definitely had a little bit of gas left on the tank for those first couple uh, incline bench sets uh, the last one obviously I had went to failure but just doing these uh, incline chest press machines the contractions on these were pretty good uh, kind of just pumping them up I could probably do better about controlling the concentric and the eccentric but today I just I don't know, I just kind of felt like going hard by any means necessary, as you can see by my feet moving a little bit. But yeah, um, now on to some chest flies. I would start off doing more like pure flies and then as it would get more fatigued I would press a little bit more um, didn't record all the sets of these obviously the camera angle is a little fucky and I could have set it up better but Jim was a little busy today and uh, kind of rushed myself in setting up it's my own fault I mean I am recording in a public gym so like I'm the guy who's in the way. That's the truth to it. But, uh, yeah. Chest went really good today. Uh, felt pretty good contractions. Um, wasn't the best pump I've ever felt, but it wasn't going to stop me from working hard. Sorry if it's a little echoey in here, uh, in my, I don't know, I guess this is technically supposed to be the dining area of the apartment, but as you can see, this is where my bench lives. Um, yeah, after that last clip, I went and did the, like, lateral raise machine. Uh, and then face pulls for rear delts. I wanted to use the reverse pec deck, but it was taken, so we may do um, you know, like four or five sets of each. And feeling pretty good about it. Just uh, honestly, I just need it to be tomorrow so I can go back to the gym. I don't know if, like, y'all ever experience this, but I'm just straight addicted to working out and moving weight, and I don't really know what else to do with my time. 
mean, I have other stuff that I'm pursuing, um, but all I really want to do or all I can really like think about that excites me or motivates me is getting back in the gym. So, uh, gonna eat some, some rice, some corn, some peas, some carrots, some, uh, ground beef, and, uh, just kind of try and chill, relax, let my body recover for tomorrow. Tomorrow's gonna be back, and, uh, yeah, that's all I really got. Uh, today went good. Just gotta get to tomorrow. Anyways, adios.